Well, times are tough economically speaking, and um, I know not a lot of us out there have uh, extra money to spend on, uh, you know, trains and train accessories and, you know, model railroading in general. Uh, but one thing that does stay constant in this wonderful hobby of model railroading is dirty track. And uh, that's something that's never going to go away. And I know there's a lot of uh, fancy track cleaning fluids and track erasers and all kinds of other nifty little uh, things that you can get to uh, make cleaning your track a lot more easy and stress free but uh, if you are like me and you live 90 miles away from a decent uh, hobby shop that has any uh, good selections on anything then you're kinda caught in a bind on that one you gotta get your stuff online or stock up the next time you're in the same city as that hobby shop. So, I'm going to discuss some ideas with y'all on um, different methods you can use in place of those expensive track cleaning uh, items, I guess you could say. Uh, first of which is acne pads. They come in, uh, obviously, <laughs> you should know what acne pads are. The little perforated cloth uh, pads that are soaked in alcohol and uh, they work wonders on clean and dirty track and uh, sponge soaked with uh, Goo Gone works as well uh, if you have uh, one of these CMX track cleaning cars like I do uh, the only way I can really get the cleaning pads those specialized cloth pads that uh, you're supposed to use on them is if I get them online because usually when I do have the opportunity to go to a hobby shop there are none in stock which is a enormous pain and uh, I got a kitten climbing on me right now what do you want? Hmm? what do you want? say hi to everybody say hi Molly hi say hi to all the people out there in YouTube land but anyway, um, if you have one of these CMX track cleaning cars like I do, uh, and you don't have the pads, you can still uh, use it. Paper towels, these thick, heavy-duty paper towels work wonders. Uh, you take them and you fold. You take on and tear off a sheet and you fold them hot dog style, like such, and then you just trim them to the appropriate length like you would them uh, them cloth pads and it works great here's one I used earlier as you can see it doesn't tear it it doesn't rip it it's thick enough to where it does the job and it works wonders and uh, I'm gonna show y'all how to do it so give me one second to get rid of this little kitten and uh, get my uh, workbench in order all right, got the track cleaning car right here. Turned over on the side so it's easier to work with. <coughs> then, get your paper towels. Tear off one sheet, just one. You're gonna fold it hot dog style. That's right, we're, we're taking it down to uh, kindergarten level. Fold it, make a nice crease so it stays folded. Then, get you a knife. Some kind of good sharp knife. And you're going to put it next to the pad. Find out how long it needs to be. And make the appropriate cut to get it just the right length. Like such. Molly, you are such a little attention whore. Then you take it, slip it in just like you would the regular cloth pad, slide the little wire retainer over top of it, do the same thing with the opposite end. When you fold them like that, they're a little bit wider than the actual pad itself. But it, it's all good. It'll work out regardless. 
and then you just repeat the process with the other pad now then as you can see it is successfully installed is it pretty no not necessarily but you know what just so long as it gets the job done it'll work and nothing else changes from the uh, CMX video that I originally posted you uh, open up this valve here so that you get sufficient airflow to get the uh, fluid going open up the actual control valve until you get the right amount dripping out at the right rate sometimes you gotta play with it a little bit but and I like to do this normally with illuminated passenger cars the reason why it cleans the rollers as well as that third rail now you just get it off rolling and you're good to go Now, as you can see, that track is shiny as a new penny. The rail heads are all nice and clean, and I can still use my nice, expensive CMX car, and I'll never be short on track cleaning pads.